most importantly, when we um, took over as the government, uh, it has opened the democratic space. Not like previously where there is the culture of fear. People are willing to speak up, that's good. Um, there's a bit more um, debate about issue. I think that is where we should be leading towards yeah, a much more open, inclusive, uh, democratic atmosphere. And that is the contribution of uh, Pakatan Harapan. The other one is really that uh, Pakata Harapan has tried their very best and I think that they are moving in the right direction is to end corruption. So we have been uh, solving issues like uh, the Tabo Haji, uh, Felda, you know, big institutions which are very important to our economy and to our people. It's actually the people who brought us into power. So we really have to do things that really uh, will reflect the needs of the people. Are we on track in terms of our manifesto? I feel that you know, we, we, there has to be a much longer time span to do that. Um, and, but are they doing it? Yes, they are doing it. Yeah. When we actually um, change the government, the expectation is very high yeah, to make things happen immediately. When um, you become the government, there are certain things that you 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 start to realize that certain things can happen, but will need some time to make it happen. So the toll is a big issue with everybody. You say that you know hapus kan uh, toll, and you didn't. But uh, what the Pakatan Harapan did is to take it in stages. I think people at the end of the day will judge on what you can do and I, I feel that you know we have to show that we are able to do things and not just say that you know uh, okay we have um, come up with a very nice manifesto and leave it as, uh, at a manifesto level but we have to now show that as a government we are able to deliver and get people uh, out of poverty get people out of this corruption, uh, no more abuse of powers, no more, um, no more um, uh, institutions where we have no access to. I would rather see that happening. Um, but of course, when, uh, when certain things comes out like ISER and uh, Rome Statute, we need to answer them. Um, the government may have weaknesses in that, that one, I, I have no doubt about that. But we have to, so therefore the government has to actually work on that. How do you get the uh, narrative out to the bigger public so that they actually understand and have two sides? Yeah? Uh, we are not getting that um, done very well, to be honest. So we, we need to. I know that people are impatient, angry uh, with all the uh, comments that are being made by the opposition and now particularly by us. But uh, as, as an ordinary person, I, we also have that responsibility to also answer that. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So, uh, do you leave it to the government only to do it? No, I don't think you should. Because if you see, if I'm a citizen and I see that something is wrong and there are lies out there, I should actually take that leadership to actually correct it. But people leave it to the government so that, um, so that you know, um, the expectation is that you are there, you know, we uh, elected you, you are supposed to do the work. Yes, that is three quarters of the way. But the quarter of the way is that the people will have to take charge and say that, you know, well, we are fed up of the lies. Stop it. But um, not many people are saying that. Yeah? So we need that uh, quarter of the population or a quarter of that voice to actually say that, you know, stop. Stop all this nonsense about race. We are saying that, you know, you have to actually voice out as an individual and not just leave it to the government to uh, do it because the government will have to also deal with a large machinery mm. that um, have a certain thinking for the past 60 over years. So changing thinking is not going to happen within the five years. So everyone has to see themselves as though 
we are we are trying to uh, make a difference to Malaysia and say that you know this is the Malaysia we want. No more nonsense about corruption, about using race to uh, to divide us, uh, using Islam to uh, shut people up. Um, no, we, we we don't accept that anymore. So more people have to say that.